British singer Rita Ora was seen touching down in Kosovo today ahead of her show to mark 10 years of independence from Serbia. The star, who was born there before her family left the country, met with Prime Minister Ramush Haradinaj as she prepares to headline an open-air evening concert in Pristina. Kosovo is celebrating 10 years of independence from Serbia in two-day festivities that started today across the country. The main ceremony takes place tomorrow, when President Hashim Thaisi and Foreign Minister Bihjet Pakali are due back from the Munich Security Conference. A special panel on Kosovo is scheduled to be held at the Munich Conference. Kosovo is recognized by 117 countries, including the U.S. and most Western powers, and has joined about 200 international organizations. Serbia, which for centuries considered Kosovo the cradle of its civilization, still sees it as part of its own territory and has the support of Russia and China. In Serbia's capital, Belgrade, Serbian Foreign Minister Ivica Dacic said Kosovo's independence remains fragile and won't be concluded without an agreement with Serbia. This is one unsuccessful experiment, Dacic insisted. This is violence against Serbia, violence against international legal order. Kosovo declared independence on February 17, 2008, nine years after NATO conducted a 78-day airstrike campaign against Serbia to stop a bloody crackdown against ethnic Albanians. In Mitrovica, the center of the Serb-dominated part of northern Kosovo, posters declaring 10 years of the occupation of Kosovo and Mitohija were put up in many places, the Kosovo Press in Albania reported. Walls in the city were covered with graffiti, the Serbian flag and a sign reading in Serbian. Kosovo is Serbia, Crimea is Russia. Mitrovica resident Bratislav Krstic said, Unfortunately, the Serb community has not made up their mind yet about this independence. Neither is Belgrade certain how they see the status of Kosovo. Kosovo has taken a first step to European Union membership by signing a stabilization and association agreement. But the country faces serious challenges besides its relations with Serbia, including the rule of law, unemployment, corruption and organized crime. Five European Union members also don't recognize Kosovo's independence.